again getting back to Mega Man Battle Network for Red Sun. So as you saw in the intro, we just got the Z-Saber chip. We'll talk more about that a little later on. For now, we're supposed to go over to Mails to get onto the net with her, but we're just going to keep her waiting a moment. I have business over in Dendome. There's something to do here that they don't particularly warn you that you can do. Also, just because it strikes me as a bit silly, despite being indoors, we're said to be in an alleyway. Can that actually be used to describe an indoor area? I've only ever heard the term alleyway describing an outdoor area between two buildings. Anyway, a card reader for the waiting room. It's not locked. Look closely. You can jack in. During the Den City Tournament, they have this place sealed off, so you can't jack into it. But we can now. And we get an unlocker. We finally have one. It's a start, anyway. I'm the latest model in card reader programs. Here we use cards instead of keys. This door's always open recently, so I've been bored. I don't think there's anything particularly special in here as far as viruses go. Some of the other subnetworks do have special stuff in them. Yeah, this looks pretty bog standard. I don't really think they're gonna just let me run, though. But yeah, for example, the drink machine actually has a rare virus in it called Weather that gave me blizzard chips. And the hot dog vendor actually has the level 2 versions of both Spiky and Volgear. So that's kind of nice. If you've been through the Tensei scenario, the Cybertop will always be here for your convenience. So you can come in here and get more air hockey chips. But there's also something pretty silly in here. Hi there. Whirr, 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 I love spinning. Why am I spinning? Well, duh, because I'm a top program. Spinning's great. That's pretty amazing. So yeah, during the week-long internet outage I had, I did do some chip and zenny grinding. It let me get all the HP memories that were currently available that I didn't have yet. It boosted up my chip library a good bit, also gave me some new program advances to play around with, and since they were being stingy about Zenny for a while there, I ended up with 64 bug frags. So, that happened. Higsby's selling chips now. A rather nice selection, but here's what I really want. Super Vulcan. 12-shot Vulcan cannon. Yes, please. The rest of them, I'll buy them at my leisure. Right now, I'd rather hang on to my Zenny. So, we're gonna modify the chip folder a bit. I definitely want that Super Vulcan. We'll replace one of the normal Vulcans. And... Z-Saver. Really? Forgot about that one. Repleroid? Shouldn't there be Reploid? Repleroid Sword cuts three times. It does 100 damage per slash, so it's pretty nice if you can hit with all three slashes. I'm going to replace one of my crackouts. Also, we're going to use the Chip Trader, because seriously, 54 Guard 1As is kind of a lot. So yeah, about getting the Z-Saver chip. You can only get one per copy of Zero Three, even if you fully restart the game, which is kind of annoying, honestly. 
I don't know if erasing your game data with, like, an action replay solves the problem, but still, kind of irritating. The chip itself, just from an aesthetic standpoint, it does bug me a little bit that it uses the Reploid version of Zero. I mean, yeah, technically it did come from Mega Man Zero 3, but there is a Zero EXE. I really wish they would have done more with him. He seemed like kind of an interesting character to me. I've also been warned against linking Red Sun with Blue Moon, probably until I've finished the main three runs of the game. So yeah, it's going to be a while before we do that. Ah, well-programmed games. Gotta love it. We're going to even things out a little bit here. There we go. I think we've kept Mail waiting long enough. Hello. Rolls on town area 3 on the net. You go too, Mega Man. Here, use this. And we got the mail code. Let's go. But with all the preliminaries taken care of, we're going to take a quick refreshing pause here. Back in a moment. Yeah, the last time I was trying to record this segment, I ended up with some major audio desync, which I'm trying to prevent this time. Hence the early refreshing pause. But anyway, now that we have the mail code, we can go through Mail Security Cube. Though it isn't really the quickest way to go where we need to go. Mail wrote about Lan in her diary. Of course what she wrote is top secret. We will go ahead and get this out of the way, though. What we really want to do is talk to this guy. Ah, Mega Man. Hello, hello. Would you like to link your homepage with this one? Doing so would create a link between the sites. That'll allow you to jump from one site to the other. Would you like to create a link? Yes, we would. Here, take the banner for this site. And so we got the mail banner. I'll just go ahead and create the link on this side. Okay, it's soccer time. So mail's page is linked through this adorable teddy bear, but we want Angry Duck. Going through Yai's homepage, that gets us right to ACDC3 which in turn gets us closer to Town Area 3. Yay for shortcuts! And as long as we're here... Yes, Invisible Path. And it leads right to this purple mystery data. So, using our unlocker... We get... An HP memory. Lovely! Can't complain about that. No thank you. Coming over here. Hi there, top man. Hmm. Well, we have Z Saber right off the bat. I don't really want to use Gut Soul just yet. Come on, front and center. It's really hard to know where to go with so many tops to keep an eye on. That was a good hit. Yep, I just don't know where to go in moments like that. Oh, but there's a good combo. Got Soul and Super Vulcan. Heck yeah! Still not quite enough. Let's see here. Well, pretty much hitting him with anything will finish him off. There we go. Top Man is easy to underestimate, but we now have a Top Man chip. And I have no idea what he's saying there. So, let's see. Top Man. Attack hit three panels ahead. How delightfully vague. But we'll go ahead and put him in the folder, see what he can do. I'm gonna replace one of my Invis chips. And back to what we're really supposed to be doing. Another bug frag for the collection.
Well, no reason this shouldn't work. Yes, I love Super Vulcan. It's just fun. So yeah, we need to get all the way to Town Area 3. Not really a problem. No, thank you. Here's everyone. Hi, Mega. Hey, Roll. Have you heard? Den City's first theme park is going to open soon. Really? That sounds cool. They're promoting the theme park here. Ah, so that's what you were talking about. It's starting! Hi, everybody! Den City's first theme park will be known as Castillo, or Castillo, I'm not really sure. Looks like Castillo to me. For kids and grown-ups alike, it's packed with excitement. We have a special invitation for all here today. Whoa! Anyone who can defeat three of my viruses will win a pair of free pass for Castillo. So, who's ready to accept my challenge? Twinkle, twinkle. <laughs> huh? Am I missing something, Roll? Wink, wink. Len, I think Roll wants me to accept the challenge. The same here. It looks like we don't have much of a choice. We don't. <laughs> I love how straightforward he is about it. I'll accept your challenge. We're okay to battle. Begin whenever you're ready. Good luck, Mega. So, let's get the show on the road. Are you ready? The winner of the battle will go on to Castillo. Can he defeat these viruses? What fate awaits our challenger? The time to find out is finally here! Battle routine, set! Execute! So we have a three-stage virus battle here. Nothing too major from the start. This should do the trick. Let's see here. Wow, they both avoided that one. That wasn't good. So yeah, these guys get an extra jump. Hyperburst! And the final battle. We have a new type of virus over there, Gaia. I mean, we've seen him in previous games. But thanks to the break element of air hockey... Because seriously... Why does it have break element? I don't know, but it's fun! Yeah, we did it! Whoa! Amazing, amazing! Congratulations! You completed the challenge in style. Please accept these Castillo free pass. Mega Man got free pass. Well done. The theme park opens in three days. Why not come with your little friend? Mega, you did it. Yep. Mega Man. We got what Mail wanted, so maybe we should jack out. Roger. Rule, you coming? Okay. Unbelievable. Oof, his busting skill is almost frightening. Here, I believe this is what you wanted. I yes, thank you. Will you be going with Yai? Well, uh, um... I'd kind of like to go, too. Maybe I'll get Dad to bring me. Well, we could... A dog!
That noise! Our house alarm! Something's wrong. And Mom's on her own. Let's go! Mail, see you tomorrow. Okay, but don't worry about me. Hurry home. I'm gone already. Len, your doghouse alarm is howling. Maybe you should check it out. We can look in here. Well, he's jumping with excitement. Emergency situation! Emergency situation! Beep, 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 beep! Nothing seems to be out of place in here. Well, except for that. Ugh. But Mom! Mom, are you okay? What happened? I was tidying your room when someone sneaked in. I remember being sprayed, but nothing else. Wait, I think I also remember hearing typing on your PC. Yes, I'm sure of it. Quickly, call the officials. I... uh... Mom, stay with me. She's been sprayed with sleeping gas. Let her sleep, Len. I'm going to get whoever did this to her. Yeah, I feel exactly the same. I wonder what the burglar wanted. No money was taken, and the room hasn't been disturbed. I wonder. Mom said that she heard the burglar doing something. Just wait until I get my hands on that burglar. Well, she said she heard typing on the PC. There's something on the PC screen. You've been warned, Len. We can easily do much worse. If you don't want those you care for to get hurt more, bring the dark chip to Park Area 2. So, we'll be taking care of that momentarily. For now, time for a quick refreshing pause. Back in a moment.